Josh Moon's a fat fuck. Period. <laughs> I, I told see this is what I mean. There's opportunity where like Ralph could do fun things and not just be like a bitter sourpuss all the fucking time. But Ralph is such a sourpuss that he will reject anything fun loving to to just complain more. I when he said this, I said, Ralph, I said on my forum, and of course he reads every post on the forum. I said, If you want, we can do a weight loss competition. I, I'm uh I don't remember how much I am. I'm I'm just I think I'm below 270 now. I've been losing weight all this year. But I said to Ralph, I said I will bet 30 ounces of silver. And I'm, of course I'm not going to take a bet in fiat money. I don't believe in fiat money. I don't want fiat money. I don't want fiat money anywhere near me. These these are the only things. This is the only value of wealth that I I will do that I will accept this bet in. And I want 30 of 30 silver ounces. And we will have an escrow. We'll use Nick Rikita or something. And we'll both send in a piece of paper that uh, is like a physical from like a doctor. Um, and uh, it'll have height and weight. Because when you go to a doctor and you get your, your physical done or whatever, I want height and weight signed and certified by a doctor as being true and authentic. Send so that 30 pieces of silver, Nick Rikita or someone else who's not retarded. And uh, we'll do it for however long you want. Six months, a year, three months, whatever the fuck. And whoever loses the most weight, pound for pound, will get, get the pot. And that's not fair, because I truly believe that, that Ralph is about five foot four. He's probably a full head shorter than I am. So uh, his BMI is much higher. His body fat percentage is going to be much higher. And, and I, can, I can tell just by looking at him. I, I, like, if you see pictures of me, I don't have any weight on my face. And I realize I'm kind of fortunate that I don't carry a lot of weight on my face. But I can look at myself in the mirror. I can see where my fat is. I can see how my body carries it. And I just don't believe for a second that Ralph is the same height as me. His BMI has to be way higher for those kind of fucking fat jowls. It's just not possible for him to be the same height as me and have that kind of fat distribution where it's like hanging on his fucking neck like that. So, but, so I'll take, I'll take the home disadvantage because I don't think Ralph has the capability to, to neck, but like, again, that's like a fantasy. Like Ralph would never accept something like that because he's not, he's not in it to like have fun on the internet. He, he wants me destroyed pedophile pedophile killer criminal josh moon you fucking you fucking criminal and you will sir you will be hauled away you will be black bagged by interpol one day for your crimes josh moon meanwhile all my shit legal in the u.s hosted in the u.s got attorneys in the u.s my money's in the u.s there's nothing that i have that's outside the u.s Except my person. And that doesn't mean shit, because I live in a country that has an extradition treaty. So if there was a crime that I've committed, n no issue whatsoever being extradited to the U.S. So, so he should just accept my offer, but he won't, because that would be too fun. And Sourpuss Ralph has to make things as not fun as humanly fucking possible. Speaking of Killstream.tv, we did hit 350! Oh, wow, I hit the wrong button again. There we go. We did hit 350. Also, I saw somebody on uh, Faggot Farms over there saying they wish they could get me to accept the weight loss competition with Null. I accepted that live on air and said, fuck you, bitch. Of course I accept. And somehow that turned into <laughs> on his show. I shit you not. I swear to God, I sat here and ran it for 15 minutes about accepting it and somehow that turned into because the guy's a fucking moron and a liar somehow that turned into i'm not sure which outweighs the other on certain days is it the idiocy or is it the liar i, I don't know honestly i'm i'm torn uh between just sheer incompetence and uh you know just uh, mendacity but regardless yeah i've already accepted that uh and i said that a million times i don't know who i guess at Mercada maybe could hold it in escrow, but you know, he would have to actually, you know, this Josh moon loser would actually have to show his face, et cetera. I don't think he's down. I don't think he's down for any type of real contest. He threw that out there. I guess he didn't think I would take it and take him up on it, but I would love to take his money on a weight loss competition. I would absolutely fucking dominate a weight loss competition. Uh, there's only one of us that's lost 300 pounds, uh, in the last three years, 
Uh, and you're looking at them right here. So, yeah, I have no qualms whatsoever about a weight loss competition with anybody, much less that fucking loser. All right, so I say that again. I, I'm, I'm wondering how that will be twisted into he denied it and, and refused to participate, but I'm pretty sure it will be twisted into that. Um, all right, let's go through. I think we have another caller or two now. Natural selection. Now I want to so, say what I actually hopped in here to say. Now, go ahead. Well, now that we've established Ralphs. that Winston Churchill is a degenerate. All right, there we go. I took the double Ralph off the screen. Okay. <laughs> anyway, what I wanted to come in here and say was, I, I don't remember if it was the Friday episode or the Monday episode of Tequila Sunrise, but you did accept the challenge, oh, the weight loss challenge. Yeah. And it's very easy to go back and listen to that. And there was another segment I wanted to kind of highlight from Tequila Sunrise on Monday because we talked about how they just say anything and just make shit up, and then they just repeat it as the truth, as the gospel. I think well, yeah, I like said here, I was the one so. who brought it up. It was some random post that he had put up on Faggot Farms, and I brought it up and said, yeah, I accept the challenge. He bet me like 30 Troy ounces of silver or whatever. And I was like, yeah, I accept. Of course yeah, I accept. 30 pieces of silver. Of course. Yeah. And I was like, yeah, I accept. Let's go. And then somehow that turned into, I don't accept, which I don't understand how that turned into that. But that's just example. Well, it's so fucking funny that you like went on an extended rant on the Monday tequila sunrise about this very thing that you'll say something and then it'll just be completely misconstrued and reported as something other than what you said and they'll just continue to spread that as the gospel even though it's just Slays. complete bullshit these people have mental these people have just mental fucking problems and you can see it every normal person sees it nobody likes these people they're gonna die alone and no one is gonna mourn them 